first couple which explains with a bit of a spotlight to try and put some more light on the subject. Um, this is my Heath Robinson uh, degassing uh, setup for resin. Um, now you've all seen, I imagine, the big long tube myself and Sandy have for cactus juice where this lid, okay, with the release valve and the, the pressure gauge with the liquid inside, that goes on top of the tube. So what I've rigged up is using this, which is a plastic bin lid and some foam. Now this would be uh, the foam of a camping mat or the jigsaw looking gym mats that we have for workshop flooring. Uh, so that cut neatly inside the, uh, the sort of base of the lid as it goes in like that, uh, which leaves the flat surface for the thing to mate on using that surface, not the rubber seal, because that rubber seal fits on the top of the ring. But I'm literally that goes flat on there. So to start with, no matter how gentle and careful I like fold in the actual mixing, it's, it's still a rank load of bubbles in there. Okay, so that's as mixed as I can do, but looks like a whisker bar. So I'm gonna go like that, like that. lid would go something like that to allow me to line up. And I've usually found that that right handed for me is right so I've got the two holes sort of like two o'clock and eight o'clock there and then I marry up one hole which would be for the gauge and then the actual suction hole over the two eyeball holes there. So something like that would allow me to do it and then the noisy thing so there's the app. There's the gauge. There's the gauge. And then the bubbles are just beginning to come on the edges of the just take a while. And I also I'm trusting the uh, strength of the plastic jug. Boom! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I'm out of there. But that's about as much um as I get in my resin tube up there anyway. So I hope that helps. So that is now slowly, gradually degassing my resin. I'll give that about 10 15 minutes, any more than that, it'll be starting to go off. I just got my six plates out, hope that helps you. It's a lid. There's some foam underneath. Cool, isn't it? 